One of the differentiating features of the 9395 UPS system is the ability to service UPM modules concurrently while the remaining UPM modules stay online without having to transfer the system to bypass. In this video, we'll show you some of the servicing processes that make this possible. With the covers removed from the power module, you can view the dual power supply boards, the control board, and the connector which is pulled to remove logic power from the entire UPM module. Once logic power is removed, we want to disengage the contactors at the bottom of the UPM. This step does require full personal protective equipment or PPE gear. Remove the two bolts, pull the bar forward and down, and you see the input, battery, and output contactors slide out together. Once the contactors are disengaged, we may then repair or replace any part of the UPM module. The IGBT pullout assembly at the top is removed by turning the camshaft to the vertical position and the device slides out. Once the IGBT module is repaired and slid back into position, turn the camshaft to the horizontal position and this makes all electrical connections and the UPM is ready to be restarted and put online.